making non, non-dancers um, into uh, dancers is, it's just like anything. I mean, it's, it's training and we train on Tuesdays for about three hours. And flip. A lot of it, honestly, is impartation from God. <laughs> um, but it really is, it's training. That was it. Archie and Caitlin. We train once a week, and it's Sorry, intense. Was it okay? If they can't handle it, then they step down. And not everyone's in every show. Go, kick, 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 and go. Kick. That's it. When I first saw diaries kind of, kind of happening and forming, I saw it as small time and something that you know was just gonna get started and she wanted to do this or, or work it in this manner. And so when it first got started, I wasn't against it, but I didn't really see it having this growth or staying power. And now it has evolved into something that is very powerful. How people get into the dance company is it's definitely a process. First of all, they attend a church. And also the second step is you're actually in one of those accountability groups, which is called a cell group. Then once you're in that group, I talk to your leader. And there's definitely a list of requirements. Praying 30 minutes a day, fasting once a week. You had to have gone on an encounter. You have to be bringing um, non-Christians, you know, really be out there witnessing constantly. And putting everything else, like putting church, putting schoolwork, putting those things above the dance team. So you're not slacking off, because a lot of times we found that the kids want to dance, they want to come do this for hours a day, but they'll put everything else off, their schoolwork. So if they slack off, they get B's, they get C's, then they're on probation. You can't walk into a dance studio and say, I want to be on this company. Uh, you walk into a dance studio, you say, you want to be on the company. They say, well, let's see what you got. Let's see this. You take this class, you go through here. And the same thing here. When you want to be a part of something, you basically immerse yourself in it. And the first thing, the first thing is where do you stand right with God? Because this isn't about performance. It's not about the show. It's about salvation and people's relationship with Jesus Christ. And so as long as that is firmly intact uh, and and it's obvious because you're living it. So if that's taken care of, the idea of getting into the arts, I would have to say to anybody is, don't worry about humility. You have to get out there and you have to try and you have to you know, not be worried about what people are thinking or where it is because if it's in you and you enjoy it, that's, that's all there is to it. And so that's what it took me and hopefully it takes guys less and less time that you just get out there and you know, listen to what the director says and you'll be good. Thank you.